How to Connect a 4250i G3 Motion System Your 4250i is composed of two power cables, two termination cables, two long shielded CAT5 cables, and one communication module called KCU needed to drive the motion system. The KCU comes equipped with a power cable and converter, as well as a USB to USB communications cable. There are two distinct ACMs in the 4250i setup. The first one in the loop is the master, and the second one is the slave. The first step in connecting your system is to power the KCU. Start by connecting the power cable to the converter, and then plug the converter into the back of the KCU. Next, connect the USB cable to the back of the KCU. The other end you see on screen will go into a computer later on. The next step will be to connect the KCU to the master ACM. The connection ports required for this step are called master out on the KCU and in on the master ACM. This next step will require you to connect the master ACM to the slave ACM. For this step, the connection ports are called next on the master ACM and in on the slave ACM. The small shielded CAT5 cable is called the termination cable. Use this cable to terminate the connection on the master ACM using port out and end. Using the second termination cable, repeat the steps for the slave ACM. To move on, you will need to power your system. You will find the power outlet on the back of your ACMs. Then, connect all your power cables to a surge protection outlet. Finally, connect the KCU USB cable to a computer equipped with the right software. Your system is now ready to use.